Welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. So I'm usually always doing my candy bonanzas. Today is a little bit different. We have these three candy bags. They are filled. So much different candy to look at. If you guys love sweet treats like I think you do, because you love all the candy bonanzas, you are going to love these bags. We have a candy bag from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Those are going to show us all the different candies they used to eat back then. And we also have some Shopkey candy jars. Cannot wait for those. Boop. First one is that yellow bag. It's called that 70s mix. Look at all those cute little 70s details on there. The color, a little retro dancer. Next one we're gonna look at is that 80s mix. Look at that cute little boom box on there. There's a break dancer. I am so curious what these sweet treats are gonna be. And the last little bag we're gonna rip open is that 90s mix. Oh, Look, it's got a cell phone and a computer mouse. They're dancing. Ooh, I see some gummy bears. And after we eat all our yummies and take a look at all of that sweet stuff, we are going to open our Shopkins. Two of the candy jars. We are starting. And we're going to go in order of all the years. So we're going to start with the 70s. <laughs> I'm sure most of us were not even born in the 70s. Maybe our parents just were getting born. And here it is, all your favorite candies. I love these bags. They have so much detail. Look at that little disco ball. Ooh, and on the back it lists all the ones that are in here. Whoa, there are just too many things. Atomic fireballs, blow pops, candy necklace, cherry heads, fun dip, gobstoppers. Ooh, they made gobstoppers back then. <laughs> I can't believe it. Laffy Taffy, Necco wafer roll, pixie sticks, rain blow. Ooh, what is that? Razzle, Smarties, and a Tootsie Roll. I'm sure we're familiar with that one. What do you guys say we open this up and reveal the 70s candy? <laughs> Whoa. Unbelievable. Such a different mix of things here. I cannot believe all of this stuff was just in that little bag there. And it's so funny because it comes with this little nutrition list of all the different candies. So you know the calories and all the sugar. But whoop, I'm going to throw that out. Let's start trying these. Too many things. Let's start with these. Ooh, what is this? Original Cherry Head Cherry Candy. Wow, and it says 25 cents. Maybe that's what it cost back then. I'm not sure. Let's open these babies up and test them. Oh, I guess they're like the lemon heads, but I've never seen the cherry ones. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> these candies are amazing. They're not even like the lemon heads. They are so, so much better. They look like little cherries, actually. And when I first saw them, I thought they were like chewy gummy candies. No, they're super hard. It kind of tastes like biting into a blow pop or a lollipop. And then once you get in the center, it's a little bit softer. It's kind of sour and sweet. These have the best flavor. Stop, ooh, how about these? Now, I have always seen these Neckos in the store. I never actually tried them. And we get, ooh, we get two of those. Look how cute these are. It says an American classic, the original candy wafer. Woo! <laughs> what is a candy wafer? See, it's got this kind of like wax paper on there. And when you unwrap, ooh, look at these. <laughs> they look like little candy discs. They kind of are weird. They have this powder or powdered sugar on it. Ooh, this one may be chocolate. It's kind of brown. Let's try. Um, I don't know what to say. They are sweet. They're kind of sweet, just like a regular candy, but not too sweet, kind of powdery. They don't have the best flavor, and I love how they come in all these colors. They're really cool. They look like buttons, but I don't like them too much. Wow, they had blow pops back in the 70s. I can't believe it. And we got a watermelon one. What else did we get? Some razzles. I love these. If you guys don't know what razzles are, I have to tell you. They're these little candies. You start chewing them and then they turn into gum. They kind of get like rubbery and turn into bubble gum. Here's this little pack of razzles and it's so miniature and cute. Usually they're like really big. And I love the colors of these. They're super bright. Ooh, we got two red ones. So here they are. They kind of look like hard candies. They're a little bit chalky. And once you start chewing them, I'll show you. 
Now I know this is super gross and some of you may not want to see this, but here's what it turns into. It turns into this bright red cherry flavored gum. It is delicious. Just like any other gum you would ever eat. That is amazing. These razzles are the best and they still sell them. They're pretty much everywhere. I see them at CVS, Walmart. You should try them. Here's another pack. I wonder if there's a different color. They come in like purple, orange, yellow, but I do have to say the red ones are so, so good. Okay. Ooh, look at, ooh, we got the yellow ones. Ooh, a yellow and a blue. I bet if you chew these together, it would turn into some green gum. And here's the blow pop. I'm sure everyone's familiar with these. If you're not, it's just a big, yummy watermelon lollipop. They come in all different flavors. And when you get to the center, there is bubble gum in there. Oh, so good. This is such a classic. Fun dip. I love my fun dip. And this one is Raz Apple Magic Dip. Wow. <laughs> I wonder why it's magic. And if you're not familiar with this, let me show you. On this side, there's this little, oops, broken, we can still use it, little candy stick, it's so cute. Kind of looks like a piece of chalk. And you just rip this part of the bag open to reveal the candy powder. No, it says Raz Apple Magic Dip. Maybe it's gonna turn into like apple flavor. It's blue raspberry. You lick this little stick and stick it in there. Look at this. Here's our little dipper stick filled with all that powdered pucker powder. Let's taste it. Mmm, so, so good. I don't know why it's called Magic Dip, but it does taste like blueberry and apple together, or raspberry. Ah, oh, so yummy. And Fun Dip is probably one of the sweetest candies ever. It's basically just sugar. <laughs> so, so good. We get some Laffy Taffies in here. I'm sure we all know what those are. And we get this one, Sour Apple and Cherry. Taffy! Here's what the green one looks like out of its package. And look how stretchy this is. It kind of looks like slime or Play-Doh, but when you eat it, it is super sweet and a little bit sour. Love them. Ooh, look at this candy necklace. It is so adorable. It's in this little bag. It's got stars on there. And candy necklaces are good for any decade. They are just so yummy. They're kind of like little sweet tarts. You can wear them as a bracelet. So much fun to birthday parties or going to the fair. Tootsie Rolls, those are classic. I actually don't like Tootsie Rolls too much because when I eat chocolate, I just want it to be nice and creamy. These are kind of like rubbery. But if you're not familiar, they're these little chocolate pieces, almost like a chocolate taffy. Get a couple more of those. And we get our Smarties. Ooh, Smarties are so good. Smarties kind of remind me like of the little pieces on the candy necklace. They are super sweet and tarty, and I love how they're all rolled up. Cutest little package ever. Here they are, all these light colors. Mm, I love when you chew them, they kind of turn into like candy powder in your mouth. So good. What else? Ooh, we looked at the Smarties. These, oh, I don't know if you guys have ever tried these before, but they are crazy. They're called Atomic Fireballs. These kind of look like a gumball, but they're not. They are super spicy and hot, kind of like cinnamon. And when you suck on these, <laughs> your tongue is going to be burning. If you like cinnamon candies or cinnamon gum, I think you'll like it. Let me try. <laughs> they are so, so burning. And your tongue turns bright red. I used to play with these with my friends. We'd see who could keep them on our tongue the longest before it was just too hot. So there's your fireballs. I kind of like these. We also get, ooh, these look like fireballs, but they're not. They're called rain blow and they're bubble gum balls. I love these. They're just like basic gumballs. Nothing too special, but they really do have the brightest colors. Ooh, almost broke my tooth. These were super hard. Not as soft as the double bubble ones. So easy with those. <laughs> and then we have, the Willy Wonka movie, one of my favorites, the Everlasting Gobstopper, and they actually make them. They're kind of different in real life though, not as cool as the ones in the movie. Look at these, they look like these little candy balls, and when you suck them, all different flavors and colors come out. Let me show you. Okay, so here this one is grape. 
I put it in my mouth for a little. I know this is gross, I just wanna show you. Look, it turned pink. And then if you keep sucking a little more, it's gonna turn like orange, all different colors, different flavors. And these are really like everlasting because you can just suck on them for a long time and they stay really big. Yummy. Wow guys, can't believe this. We made it to the end of the 70s bag and what we're left with are the pixie sticks. Pixie sticks are super yummy. They're like these little plastic, or not plastic, they're kind of like paper straws. You just rip off one end and there's all your yummy pucker powder. And the three of these are great. Delicious! This little pixie stick powder is so tarty and sweet. I love these. Usually I'll only eat one at a time just because they're almost pure sugar, but they're really good. So we finished our bag of 70s candy. We tried all of it and it was super cool. <laughs> I loved all of them. Most of these candies I've tried. Some of them I haven't. Let's move on to the 1980s. Here it is, that 80s candy mix. Oh, and I love this bag. It's purple, it's got this cute little purple ribbon. So on this one, we get like a boom box. This little guy is dancing. What else? Oh, a Rubik's Cube. <laughs> I guess those were invented in the 80s. This looks like some kind of video game guy. And there's tons in here too. Airheads, wow. <laughs> Blow Pops, candy necklace. Ooh, some of these are the same. Cry Baby, Laffy Taffy, Lemon Heads, Mini Crunch. What is that? <laughs> Nerds, Red Hot, Six Slits, Sweet Tarts, Sour Patch Kids, and Twizzlers. Ooh, there's a lot of different ones in here. Some are the same. What do you guys see? We crack this bag open and check it out. Here we go, no time to waste. Another table full of candy to test out. So, ooh, we get some Red Hots. It says cinnamon flavored candy. Mm, these might be like those atomic fireballs. Sometimes I like these spicy ones, sometimes I don't. Let's see. Oh, they're so cute. They look like those cherry ones. Ah, those are so, so spicy, but I like them. These are another ones. I think I have tried these before and I used to play with my friends and see who could hold them in our mouth the longest. They are so good. They kind of taste like cinnamon gum. What else is new in here? Ooh, the Sour Patch Kids. Ooh, these are big ones. I guess those were invented in the 1980s and we get three of them, orange, blue, and green. I've never seen Sour Patch ones like kind of wrapped up like this. These are almost one of my ultimate favorite candies. And <laughs> they just have the best taste. Mmm, the green is so yummy, like a sour apple. I think sour patches were probably the best invention ever. They're so chewy, they're so sour. Ooh, here's the orange one, and we get a blue. Too bad they didn't have any red ones. Those are my faves. Oh, here's the mini crunch, <laughs> Nestle Crunch Bar. I'm sure we all know these. I love these, I always get them in Halloween time. Just some chocolate, it's got little pieces of puffed up rice or like Rice Krispies. Mmm, love chocolate. Ooh, you even get some sweet tarts. These look like the Smarties from the 70s, but they're even better. <laughs> they are sweeter, a little more tangy. They're so good. And sweet tarts come in all different sizes. There's big ones, chewy ones. There's pink, yellow, all the pastel colors. Mmm. You get some extras to share with your friends. Ooh, Airheads. What is this? So, as you know, Airheads, now in this year, what is it, 2016, they make about a billion different flavors. Back then, I guess they just had the plain old cherry. And you can never go wrong with an airhead. It's kind of like Laffy Taffy, but even better. Such a good taste with these. We get some 1980s lemon heads. Now, I've never been a fan of the lemon heads. I don't even know what they are. They're just like a candy bowl. It's not bubble gum. It's not really too sweet or too sour. It has a faint taste of lemon, almost like lemonade. I don't know. I don't like these too much. Twizzlers! Twizzlers are my ultimate favorite movie theater candy. I love to get Twizzlers and eat them with popcorn. Ooh, I actually like Milk Duds too. So here they are. We get two of these, just the regular 
red one. Now they make rainbow, strawberry. These are just like the basic flavor. Here we go. Ooh, broke. And that's what a Twizzler looks like. It's pretty much strawberry flavored licorice. We get some. Ooh, I don't know if you've tried these before. They're so good. They're called Six Lips. Cutest little name. And they're these chocolatey coated candies. Almost like M&M's. But not as good as M&M's. They're a little bit lighter. And a little bit more crunchy. Oops, but I love them just because they're so chocolatey. And I love all those cool colors. Mmm. We still have some left. And we have Crybabies. Crybabies are the best. I remember I used to get these when they first came out on my way to school. So good. And there's extra sour ones. They're like these sour, sour gumballs. We have lemon, ooh, cherry, that's my fave, and green apple. Here's a close-up of the Crybaby packages, and I love how the guy on the front is crying. <laughs> he kind of looks like Bart Simpson, I don't know. So let's see, here it is. Now on the outside of this gumball, there is so much sour powder or sugar. It literally will just, it will make you start tearing up. These are the best. Get another Bolo Pop in this bag. The other one was watermelon. This is the sour apple. And I could just unwrap it to show you if you're not familiar with the Bolo Pop. Oop, it's just a green lolly. And when you bite it, which you're not supposed to do, <laughs> but I'll just show you the inside. You make your way to the bubble gum. What else? We get some nerds. Oh, I love nerds. Seriously, strawberry flavored. That's perfect. That's my fave. Here we go. Nerds have been around forever, and I think they're going to stay around for eternity. <laughs> they are just too yummy. They're these little, they look like little candy rocks, but they have the biggest crunch and so sweet. Perfect flavor. Left candy, we get Laffy Taffies. Now in the other one, we, ooh, we got sour apple before. This time we also get a banana. I love banana flavored candy. <laughs> I love anything that's like tropical, like pineapple, banana. And I could show you, look at this yummy yellow one. <laughs> this, I've had these before. They really do taste like you're just biting into a banana. They are so fruity. Probably one of my favorite Laffy Taffy flavors. We also get another candy necklace. Can't go wrong with those. Share it with your friends. And that's that. We looked at all the 80s candy onto the 90s. And then it's time for the Shopkins. Here it is, that 90s mix. We've made it through 30 years of candy, if you can believe it or not. And some of the candies kind of stayed the same. Most of them are still around. And here it is. Now this bag is so funny. It's got a cell phone, like those were invented in the 90s. A cute little computer mouse. These two are dancing. <laughs> Ooh, some singing. Oh, look at that, a floppy disk, a CD. This is just too, too funny. And here is the candy inside. Heads, ooh, we got those before. Bazooka gum, crybaby, e-fruity gummy burger. Ooh, I love those. Haribo Gold Bears, Laffy Taffy, Mike and Ike Zowers, Nerds, Now and Later, ooh, a Smarties Pop, and Sour Punch Twist. Let's do this! Ah, colorful! I think the 90s had the most colorful mix of candies. I don't know about you, the other ones were a little dull, but uh, look at all of these bright ones. So, oh, I love these. I haven't had them in forever. They are the Mike and Ike Zowers. Oh, look at those little guys on there. So, they're made with real fruit juice. They used to be 25 cents. And sour fruits. Chewy sour fruit flavored candies. I don't even remember what they taste like. I just know they were so, so good. <gasps> look at these. Now, the regular Mike and Ikes were kind of like shiny. These are a little more powdery because they are super, super sour. <laughs> Let's try this red one. If you guys love Sour Patch Kids, Cry Babies, all of those sour ones, these will be the best. You're going to love them. And I know they still sell these. I've seen them at like the Dollar Tree and other stores. You should check them out. What else? Ooh, we get Smarties Pops. Remember those cute little Smarties rolled up candies? Now they make lollipops of them. 
They are so, so cute. They have like these different layers of sugar flavor. Let me show you. Here it is, and does that not look like a Smartie? It looks huge. It's got like a cherry flavor, and then the blue at the bottom. And this one looks like it's orange and yellow. So, so good. We get some Haribo Gold Bears. These are classic. You can find them anywhere. They're those little gummy bears. They're kind of chewy and tough. And they have the yummiest flavors. I see pineapple, peach, orange. Let's taste them. Haven't had these in a really long time too. They are regular gummy bears. They just are a little bit more chewy. Mm. Another good one from the 90s are the Now and Laters. I used to eat these all the time. So here they are. We get like a cherry, strawberry, and apple. These are kind of like Takis. Now, ooh, these are the soft ones. So Now and Laters used to be super hard and you would just chew them and they would get soft. It's like a brick of taffy, but they are so, so sour, kind of chewy. I can't even describe them. They're just too, too good. We also get the strawberry one. I think it's pink. I used to love this flavor so, so much. I'm so happy these were in here because I usually don't see them in the store lately. <laughs> There's a strawberry and the cherry is like a bright red one. It's almost the same color. They look like bubble gum. Rabbit Patty! Actually, just joking, it's not, it's almost like one. Oh, these are so good. They're the E Fruity Mini Burgers. And I'm sure you've had these before. They actually make so many different ones now. They have like popcorn and soda. Too many of them. But here's the original. I guess it was a little burger. It does look like a Krabby Patty. And the top is the bun. It goes into the little pickle, and I guess that's a cheese. There's the burger. Love these e fruities because they're super creamy, not just sour, they have a really good taste. Sour punch straws, here they are. These are super good. <laughs> we get two, oh no, we get three of them. Four, wow. So we get green, that's the green apple. We get the red and the blue ones. These are kind of like, they look like Twizzlers, but they're not, they're like licorice are candy, gummy candy, but they are wrapped in so much sour sugar, just like a Sour Patch Kid. Mm, these are another one of my faves. I love anything that's sour. Here's what the blue one looks like. Kind of a pretty blue. This one must be like raspberry, and the green apple is good too. We get some more nerds, another Seriously Strawberry, and Ooh, lemonade wild cherry. I've had these before. They are so, so awesome. Do you look at that color? <laughs> it is so, so bright. And these are so cool because they taste like lemonade and they taste like cherry at the same time. I don't know how they did that. So we get that color and the classic strawberry, which are good. I think I like these a little bit more. Then I also like the pink ones because they're just so cute and bright. Ooh, so many more left. So we get cherry, banana, another cherry, and the sour apple lappy taffy. Can't go wrong with those. Ooh, this time we get an airhead blue raspberry yummy. So here's the blue one. Love these. One of my favorite airhead flavors is the birthday cake one. I don't know if you've tried it. It's so, so good. So there's the blue and classic orange. And airheads have the most amazing shine to them. They don't even look like candies. We are left with bubble gum. We get bazooka. I love bazooka gum because when you open them on the inside, I don't know if you've ever seen these, but they have like a cute little comic strip cartoon. Let me show you. So you unwrap it. Ooh, if I can get it. Okay, there's your gum. And inside. Ooh, you get a little bubble wrap. Usually they used to be little cartoons. Now it's a bubble wrap. It says, make a wrap using these words. Turtle soup, swoop, rock group, hula hoop. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> Seems a little complicated. So we also have these cry babies. We had those in the other decades. We get blue, red, green. We are finished. 
finished, we tried all the candy from the three decades, and I have to say out of all three decades, I think I liked the 90s the best. They had the best mix, but I loved all three of them. So many good ones. I am <laughs> super, super hyper right now. I ate so much sugar. Shopkies, it is Shopkies time to open our food fair candy jars. How funny, we have candy video and the candy Shopkins. These are so adorable. They're all different seasons with a twist on them. Let's open. Pop the top. Our little jelly beans. Our little line bags are in there. And I am so excited because yesterday I opened one of these and I got Rainbow Bite <laughs> from season one. That was so awesome. So here is the first. Who are we going to get? This seems really little. Oh, I love this one. I actually have it. But it's such a goodie. Fifi Fruit Tart. She is Miss Fifi Fruit Tart. Ooh, she looks so yummy. She's kind of like a fruit pie, all those colors. And she's from season two. Adorable. For the second one, ooh, this one is big. Kind of feels like a square. <gasps> oh, I love it. I actually have it, but I'll take another. Look who we got, Waffle Sue. But she's this adorable light blue color. She's got some orange ice cream or yellow ice cream on top. Here's our Waffle Sue. She's light blue. Usually from season two, she was like a brown, like a regular waffle color. But this one is so pastel and bright. And yeah, for our second little jar, these two were duplicates. Hopefully I'll get some different ones. What's it gonna be? Look who we got, everybody. We got Cherry Churro from season two. I have the Cherry Churro in so many colors now. This one is like a blue with a pink dip. And the final of the day. What's it gonna be? What is this? Oh, woo! Got it. Oh, we got this little purple macaroon from season three. It's purple with some light blue cream inside. And look at that adorable little heart there. Here's the four we collected today. Our little Shopkin Sweeties. We got Waffle Sue, Fifi Fruit Tart, Cherry Churro, and Macaroon. All three of these are from season two. This is the only one from season three. Love them all. There it is, another fun one. We looked at all that retro candy. We opened some Shopkies, and we're gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.